I'm going to take this caller. Caller, you're live on the air. What's your name, comment, and or question? Hey, Ben. It's David, New York. Um, just a comment on both bills, really, both, well, both issues, the uh, House uh, with John Lewis is sitting and, and the Senate vote on um, surveillance, mm-hmm. really tying them together. So both, b- both of them are really bad compromises or, uh, and bad proposals. Yep. And everyone, at least on the progressive side, sees that for the most part. Yep. The issue is, is you can't stop it without doing something about it, without activism. And I just wanted to tie it together and bring up, um, I don't know if you or a lot of the viewers saw it, but John Oliver did a, P, uh, did a segment on the NRA this past Sunday. And one thing he pointed out is one reason it's been so hard to stop to, to, to um, get progress on gun control is because of the NRA's, not, not their lobbying job, but their mobile, mobilizing job, they're, they're, the, mm. the fact that they get their members mobilized. Yeah. And that's yeah. not the answer, the, the silver bullet. It's not the only piece of it, but it's a huge piece of it. Yeah. You know, when, when people say, call your senator, call your congress member, it doesn't mean tweet them or send them an email. Emails are good, at, but... You'll, you'll end up get a, getting a, an auto response that isn't actually from them. Call mm. the office. Call them every day. Call them, you know, twice a week. But the only way to, 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 to actually make it known is to bombard them because they're getting bombarded by the other side. Mm. And, you know, that's not just going to control its surveillance or anything else. And obviously there's money in politics, so, you know, we, we're fighting that too. But you have to use your voice if you want to get anywhere. Yep. David, I can't agree with you more. Um, And I I like what you said. Thanks for the call. I like what you said in terms of it's not just the NRA's lobbying power, it's their mobilization power, which is why I put a lot of emphasis on what um, Bernie Sanders um, is, um, is a bequeathing. (laughs) I don't know. I think that's the word. He's bequeathing to the progressive movement is a mobilized progressive movement. Uh, and, and we need to, um, we need to put pressure on people, man. That's why I agree with you 100%.